what's up everyone welcome back to chain reactions just doing a little chain reactions session i saw they have a dance practice for tgif which uh i loved so i definitely want to check it out let's see what they got well i know what they got when i'm with my ladies all the party don't stop and we don't need no fire because we already high fresh so clean Steve. the scene Ooh. drip red, oh, i like that they're on the side and she's still doing the one way walk not to, mm. to high up yeah, yeah, to give yeah, up yeah, yeah. when PBS has got nothing on me. One egg got it from I like the changing I angles, that's pretty dope. Please what blessings look at my body. Wake up, look up in the mirror. T G I F Sheesh. Then got them flat. Hey, I like the little bounce, they yeah. They move as a unit so well. It's crazy. Cocky, I call it true. Ooh, I like that. I'm so tahiti, hot and breezy, off the heezy, on the IG, white TT, fresh to death, my flying is best, like Kevin sent me, got my witness, the drips to take me. Love it. Ooh, la, la, my ladies, get your moon. Ooh, la, la, my ladies, never cooler. All across the globe and not the solar. Nobody call me close when we show up. BBS is God. Tell him she's so. Again, moving as a unit, hopping in a circle like that, in sync. I love this runway stuff, man. Not even looking, hands back, they're not looking, hands back, link up. Like, just coordination, the amount of practice and effort and talent. Reese's. I love that. I love that little Vogue session right here. Huh. God damn. Damn. Then got them fly. Oh, this is dope. Yeah, that's cool. Work it, work it, work it. So fucking cool, man. What I really like, I mean, I already knew the song was was dope because I've uh, I did the music video. Check that out if you haven't seen it. What I think, it, what I thought was really cool was the way that like they incorporated. So in the music video, she's gigantic and you know she stomps and it's like a giant foot and then transitions into the car. Um, they're doing the same like movements, but making it work on like an actual real scale without special effects. So I think it's pretty cool. Um, and I really like the the way that they sell that pause. They do that, like that little bounce. I also thought that what was really dope was the way that they changed the angles up. And yes, it's camera work, but this is a dance practice. So I'm assuming this is what they're going to do on stage. And if they have a stage where there's an audience looking at different angles, that, that's a really, really cool and creative and exciting way to engage different parts of the crowd at different times. Um, Something with like set pieces and like lining up multiple people. It's sometimes those formations work really well head on. And then you can still appreciate it if you're not head on, but you do lose a little something. If you've got people doing crisscrossing runways and they're posing and striking a pose and looking at the crowd and the crowd can see them from different angles. 
Uh, I think that's a really cool touch. I think that that's something that I feel like that would kill uh, at a live at a live performance or at a live show at a concert. Um, so that's I thought was super cool. Also wanted to just um, I don't know if Kokona usually dresses uh, like this. I'm not that's not critical in any way. Just noticing that a lot of times she dresses in more of like a tomboyish kind of way. So. It almost took me a second to register that, you know, they're wearing leggings with like a pink, like kind of crop top sort of thing with the pigtails and stuff. I mean, she looks great. They all look great. Uh, I know it's a dance practice, so they usually will wear like stuff that looks a little more casual uh, and they don't match as well and stuff. So it's always interesting just to see them not in like the, the you know, performance costume sort of fit. So uh, thought that was pretty cool. Obviously, love them. Can't wait. I saw that uh, the mini album only has like i think two or three songs that we haven't heard before which is a little bit of a bummer i, I said this i think in in my tgif uh reaction that like i'm just greedy i want them to come out with like a 10 song album but it's a mini album so maybe they'll come out with another one later i know that that seems to be how a lot of these groups do it um, so instead of waiting for years between full albums you just wait a shorter amount of time between mini albums so Maybe I just need to get used to that. It's not like the the Western style of albums. But yeah, let me know what you think. Um, if they've done live performances of this, if I'm just totally making up that aspect about the angles. But I, I think that would be a really cool thing that they could do that would really kill it. Like this here, no matter where you are, you can appreciate this. But if you happen to be over there, that would be awesome. Then if you're over here, they turn and they face you. That would be dope. It just seems like a way to please the most people. Uh, and then again, they move so well as a unit. I will just never not appreciate that. They practice. They have to work so hard. I know it's a ton of talent. I know it's you know natural, but also they have to work so hard um, just to coordinate, just to work with each other. And you can see in their faces, you know, they're serious, but they're having fun. They trust each other. They know each other. The parts where they're not looking at each other, but they're still lining up. They're able to grab each other's hands without looking. Just incredible. And I know this is a dance practice, but I still want to appreciate Maya absolutely tearing up her rap verse. Always got to give Maya the shout out. Got to give Maya the love. Um, the rest of the group kills it. Chisa owns this shit. Um, I loved all of this. I, I really love this group. I like this song. I'm excited for the rest of what they got. Let me know what you think in the comments. And until next time, stay fresh.